What's going on, y'all? Appreciate y'all tuning in tonight. Hang out here in the garage with us for a little while. Hey, we're shooting crappie baits tonight. Got several different modes set up already. Got the plastis all cooked in the shooting star. We're gonna be doing some laminates tonight in the crappie baits. So y'all hang out with us. We'll show you what we're shooting tonight. All these sitting up here in the mold. Now we're gonna flip the camera around and show you some that we've already shot off camera. Uh, we'll share one of our recipes we you tonight off something that we've shot. Uh, something with, that we've either already shot or something we're shooting tonight. Y'all hang out with us. We'll get the camera flipped around and kind of show you what we've got already got on the wall of curing. Hot pink over monkey milk. No color we like to call strawberry milk. And then we've shot some just some straight some straight fluorescent pink. In the two inch and the three inch. Some stuff that we've already shot off camera tonight. We just wanted to share it with you and kind of give you guys a little look see here. Like I say, we'll share one of our recipes later on in the video tonight for you guys. Let's get these out of the molds and see what they look like. Check it out, y'all. So color it we call Midnight Slab Doc Slab Doctor. We caught lots of crappie off this color here. Point five may fly in it. Got 
several different several different mold companies represented out here tonight in the crappie baits. You guys that shoot angling, uh, angling AI molds, you all know that uh, they don't have a very they don't have a very big offering in the panfish line of baits. We do have three of their molds. I really wish they would expand that, but they haven't, so we have to go other places to find our molds. Check this out. We call that the kicking minnow. It's a fat guy fishing mold. 1.75 kicking minnow. Lots of action in the water. One of our favorite baits to fish up there. We're the only reason we have the clamps on these molds tonight is just to help stabilize them when we're shooting. So that's the only reason they're there. Just try to keep from turning molds over when you get this many set out, but and don't have them all. They're all different sizes, so it makes it makes it kind of tough to to shoot without turning some over. There's the angling AI 2.25 minnow. you guys to think those molds didn't shoot good they shoot fine I just like I say I've got the, the clamps on them just to help stabilize them while I'm shooting the two inch in the epic bait mold the two inch minna I think they call it uh, crappie slayer uh, we call it a minna Get these filled back up. Y'all hang out with us. You guys watched the video, the last video when we done our review on the three inch minna from uh, Epic Bait Modes. And, you know, we told you that it probably wouldn't be the last one we purchased from them, and, and it has. And we went ahead that night and uh, ordered the, the two inch version in it. It wants you guys thinking I was holding back on you, telling you only, that was the first mold I had. And it was, we liked it so well that we went ahead and, and ordered the, the two inch version in it that night. Got it in yesterday. Today's actually the first time we've shot it.
and it actually shoots just as good as the three inch does. We're, we're very pleased with them. Very pleased with them we are. All right, we're going to finish this round up. And we'll meet you back here, share one of our recipes with you here in just a few minutes. Y'all hang out. We'll show you what all we come up with at the end of the night. I appreciate y'all tuning in tonight for another episode of LCL Outdoors. Hey, you got some baits laid out here. Just want to kind of give you guys a a little look see give you a give you a new recipe to try kind of show you some different variances some things that you can do using the same colors and change the whole outlook of the of the bait um, lots of things you can do uh, bass baits crappie baits uh, just changing the location of the color you can make the bait look completely different i'm going to flip the camera around here and show you some baits and i'll walk you through the recipe how to get this color Appreciate y'all tuning in tonight. All right, y'all, this is a color that we call strawberry milk. It's a combination of hot pink uh, laminated with a uh, monkey milk color. A lot, of, a lot of options you can do with this. As you can see, you got the hot pink uh, top and the uh, monkey milk belly there that's the two inch there it is in the three and here's a little different option you can do with it do the monkey milk bottle body on the single tail grub with the hot pink tail or you could flip it and do the hot pink body with a monkey milk tail shot these for one of our customers <coughs> excuse me one of our customers that's uh, what he requested was the monkey milk body with uh, hot pink the hot pink tail like I say there's a lot of different a lot of different options you can do with that slab slapper bait that we call slab slapper hot pink laminated over monkey milk and then there's a 1.5 mayfly in it show you guys what we came up with there tonight Hey, just want to say thank y'all for tuning in, hanging out with us here in the garage tonight. We'll always shoot some soft plastics. Hey, we're going to walk you through the mixture of the baits that we just showed you there that we call strawberry milk. 
give you guys something a little different, something to try. Uh, we measured that out in a two cup measuring cup is what we use. We've got some blue highlight powder from Barlow's Tackle. It's blue highlight uh, 921. We put one quarter teaspoon per two cups of plastic. That's the, that's the mixture we like. It doesn't completely cloud it up like milk. You still have a little transparency through it. Uh, and we get the best results for our preference, we get the best results there. One quarter teaspoon per two cups of plastic. And the pink that we used was is a hot pink by MF. Uh, it's a non-bleed, 3370 times two. We put 40 drops per cup, 40 drops per cup of the hot pink in the laminate. The laminate is what we're calling strawberry milk. Um, like I say, the, the, the pink single tail grub, that was a request. That was a request from a customer of ours. Uh, he liked the color, he wanted it a little bit different. A lot of options you can do with that, even with the minnows. You could shoot that, you could shoot the tail in the monkey milk color and shoot the body in the hot pink. A lot of variances, vice versa. It's endless what you can do shooting your own plastics. If you've ever considered, you don't have to go big time. You can order a couple molds, a couple of baits that you really like to use, the mina, and shoot numerous different colors for yourself. That's the, the great part about shooting your own baits. The options that you have are endless uh, and you don't have to spend a ton of money to, to shoot enough baits for yourself to go to the lake and catch a mess of crappie or bass or whatever you want to do uh, you can buy you can buy single bait molds where you only pour one bait at a time and they're not they're not super expensive uh, just a little information for you there tonight give it a try if you if you've ever thought about it take the leap buy you some molds or a couple molds start out with one two whatever you want there uh, buy you a couple molds uh, injector you shoot you some baits take it out catch some fish on it i promise you there's nothing any more rewarding than being able to create your own baits take them to the water and catch fish on them just want to say thank y'all Appreciate each and every one that's subscribed to the channel. Y'all stay tuned. We got lots more content coming. Be sure and hit them buttons before you leave. Until next time, thanks for watching. LCL Outdoors.